Hey guys, William Shat here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up in, and install your own DPS meter. Uh, there's been a lot of videos lately of uh, a couple guys going around doing a ton of crazy, insane amounts of damage, and uh, you know I'm sure a lot of people are just saying, oh, "How do you how do you see the how do you set up your own damage meter?" You know, um, well I'm going to show you how. Uh, in this video, you know, it seems that the uh, mentality in the game is is still kind of sticking with um, DPS to the top, race to the top type mentality. So you need a tool that kind of helps you along and, and tells you, you know, what builds are viable, what builds are not viable. Like how much does something change when I change this item? Um, this tool is really comprehensive and can really help you out in a big way. Uh, it doesn't violate the terms of agreement uh, for Star Trek Online unless they say something completely different. Uh, basically, the way it works is that the uh, the combat log reader doesn't actually interfere with the game at all. It just reads a file that is created uh, inside the folders inside the game. So it doesn't actually interfere with the game. It's not an add-on to the game. It just can sit alongside the game. That's all. Uh, so first thing we want to do, I'm going to open up a browser, and I'm going to link, I'm going to have this link uh, in the description below. Basically you just go to it, starts the download right away. Opens up the file, you're going to extract it. Uh, yeah, downloads is fine. So basically all you're going to need to do, click on this .jar file, it's going to open it up, search for updates, it's, it's that simple, it just searches for the updates, so it has an update, we're going to do that. Installs the update. Alright, I like to close that and then open it up again. Every time you're going to open it, you're going to click on this .jar file. That's what you're going to use to open it, not the not this logo. Actually, what does that logo do? Oh, it's just a logo. I don't know the point of it. Anyway, open it up. Let's close that out. And it says, oh, you're going to read combat log. Oh, we get an error. Error reading combat log. Please make sure the file exists and write stow combat log dot log. So here's what you have to do. You have to go find the combat log dot log file. All right. So let's browse the directory. Uh, let's see. I think we were. Yeah. Let's try program files. Perfect world. And it might be different for you depending on what, what loader you use. Uh, so, Star Trek Online. Hmm. Star Trek Online. Uh, you're going to want live. You're going to want logs. Game client. And there it is. Combat.log. Combat.log.log. So, that's, that's the way you can do that there. So, it basically picks up the reader. I'll just go ahead and read it. Do you want to do this anyway? Let's see. It may take a few minutes. Yeah, read it. What do you got? So now this will basically, it's just going to pick up what was there in the last fight that I had. See? So there's there's the combat log, the, the last fight I had. So you can look at this stuff later and, and use it to analyze it. Uh, there's a couple other things that you can do with this. And I'm going to show you that as well, because uh, there's a lot of features in here. And it can be overwhelming, and I don't even know it all. Um, but, you know, you can get really granular here. You can kind of, I mean, you could go down to, oh, what did this nanite sphere do? You know, how, how much DPS did he do? 
but you know, I mean, you could look at you know what the warp core breach did. I mean, plasma torpedoes did. You know, all this stuff. So, I mean, you can really get in pretty in depth. So, uh, let's see. You can have you can have your pets just accumulate on you. Or you can also show what your pets did. See, now I have what my pets were doing. So, and actually, I'm going to do a video down the road. Uh, if they put it, because I know there was big talks of them changing um, the pets and kind of talks of it being nerfed. I'm going to compare what the DPS of they are, what the DPS is of them, right, of, of what it is now and what it is if it goes to Tribble. And I'll pay attention to that as best I can and, and we'll look at that so uh, there are some other features and I'll show you that right now okay so also in the bottom here uh, there's this thing called mini right basically what it does it opens up a small version of this table here Oops, come on. So it pops up over here, and what you can do is slide it over to your game, set it up wherever you want it, push it, you know, move it all around the screen. I guess here's a good enough spot. Click no frame. It shows our DPS right there, and it's actually transparent, so that's kind of neat. So you can see through it. I imagine I could probably adjust that a little bit more to be a little more transparent. But uh, basically, if we go, let's say we go into, uh, I don't want to go conduit, because if I get a bad pug, I could fail it. So let's do, where is it? Let's do crystal. Why not? And what you have to do down here is type in combat, and it pops up. Type in 1 to turn it on. It's basically a switch. You type in combat 1, it tells, tells the file to turn on. You type in combat 0, it'll turn off your reader. You can type in combat 1 as many times as you want. It won't change, it'll still keep it on. So it looks like they're already fighting in here. It's already recording the top scores right now so let's jump in here see if I can't get my name up there huh oh there it is I'm doing 5,000 DPS so far not a lot Run away. Uh oh, didn't, didn't avoid that one, did I? Oh, yeah, they 
we're wrecking this thing real fast. So I got second place. Hooray! Let's kill the rest of the Tholians. the DPS meter. Let's move that up there. That's a bad spot for it. But as you can see, it, it recorded all of our DPS. Um, didn't do as good as I wanted to. I, I was hoping I could do a little bit more. Uh, there's some guys out there, I mean, obviously they're doing, like some of these videos, they're doing 100k DPS, which is insanity. Um, and it's basically just min-maxing that they're doing there. They're doing tons of math, tons of calculations, and, and they use this exact tool to do it. They figured out what works, what gives the best uh, uh, crit severity, crit chances, all that stuff. Um, I don't play like that. I just, you know, I play with the, the, the gear that I like to play with. And, in fact, I'm missing some. Oops, forgot to upgrade. Anyway... But, you know, I play with the gear I want to play with. And that should be all that matters. You know, you should you should play the way you like. If along the way you can optimize your DPS uh, by using this tool, uh, I would do it. But as usual, as always, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, like it, subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you back here next time. <laughs>